The Speaker of the Cross University House of Assembly, Honorable John Gonlewa, has said that a lot of cross severance don't understand what a constitution is or what constitution amendment is. Honorable John Gon made a statement over the weekend while speaking on a topical issue radio program. The dialogue with Agba Jalingo, which holds Sundays on Hit 95.9 FM Calabar, when asked how he engages cross variants, since he had said creating a website in the 21st century is reverse engineering. Okay, I'll push it out uh, to Jalingo, uh, who will be asking a few questions on the permutations of uh, uh, what, what are the permutations uh, issues, uh, what should uh, cross variants be expected of Jalingo? Thank you, my good friend Agba Jalinko. You should know. You, will, uh, I think, the first uh, answer I want to say, uh, put out is that first, I cannot. The House of Assembly cannot um, automatically change the the challenge which is society is facing, which is lack of infrastructure for communication. Uh, the man in Ubudu, in Otubuan, our Ubudu, cannot go to the website, cannot look at the website to get what is going on, or go on Twitter. So that one, um, even if even if you have, which we do, there's a website, but it's not as functional as you expect. If there's a website, it won't solve the problem. Now, on constitutional amendment, you can't deal with constitutional amendment, you know, like as if you are dealing with um, the rights of traditional rulers under the traditional rulers council's law. Now, there are a lot of people, it's, um, it's, it's segmented, it's a sectoral issues. Apart from those people who are lawyers and apart from people who are enlightened like you in society, a lot of Christians don't understand what the constitution is or what constitutional amendment is. I can't go to Abbey and call people and start talking, no, this constitutional amendment, local government autonomy. I'll be talking to a, a crowd and I'll be looking at me with askers. What we've done is this. This current constitutional amendment, these first 15 bills are very technical issues. They are professional issues. Like, for instance, the one dealing with the powers to amend the powers of the Supreme Court. You won't throw it, you won't go to what market and tell people to come and make contribution about the powers of the Supreme Court. But you need to deal with the sector that is involved. So we are, the chief judge of the state is appearing. Uh, Nelan, the member senior advocate of Nigeria, Mba Okweni, the MBA chairman, and lawyers will be there to deal with that sector issues. And judges across Federal High Court and Court of Appeal have been invited. And we have gotten inputs from them. Now, the other aspect is with the independence of INEC, the powers of INEC. I don't see how every Crossoverian we need to go to local government and start educating them on the powers of INEC. That one has to deal with the proper sector. There's an amendment dealing with the powers of the police force. You know, civil society groups who are relevant in respect of police force and all of that were engaging them. Then the other one has to do with the independence of the legislature, which will be handled. The powers of the governor to present the budget on or before the 31st of every month is being dealt with. The uh, reducing the power of the governor to spend without the budget. Also, we, these items are all Which is whittled down from yes. six months to three, three months. Three months. Now, then there's a quote they call the President Jonathan Syndrome, which ensures that if you continue um, over somebody's tenure as vice president, you cannot spend more than a tenth. These things are all technical issues. So it's, it doesn't deal with the issues that you can take to the marketplace and start dealing with. Now, with the platform, what we've done is that a lot of our colleagues are holding town hall meetings. I can tell you that something held in Ububra and then something held in the com we distributed in such a way that as it affects that we'll deal with. Now the amendment that we need to take to the field is the local government autonomy. Because then 
even local government, senatorial district by senatorial district, should be able to engage. And that is why we have postponed that public hearing to give us enough time. Because of the first period, you won't get the attention of people enough. Achibong Jeremiah, Crossbow TV.